students and a very warm welcome to our today's math session. In our today's session, we are going to learn about the theorem of Pythagoras. But before we begin with the concept, let's revise some basic concepts related to it. In a triangle, if any one angle is 90 degree, that is called as a right angle triangle. And the side which is opposite to a right angle is called as a hypotenuse. Now, if I talk about triangle ABC, angle B is 90 degree. So, the side which is opposite to angle B, that is side AC, that is going to be the hypotenuse of the triangle. In triangle LMN, angle L is 90 degree. So, the side opposite to angle L, that is MN, that is going to be the hypotenuse. Now, in triangle XYZ, angle Y is 90 degree. So, XZ will be the hypotenuse. So, these are the things which we need to take care of. Now, let's begin with the Pythagoras theorem. Pythagoras theorem is applicable compulsorily to a right angle triangle. And what it says, in a right angle triangle, the square of the hypotenuse will be equal to the sum of the remaining two sides square. So, what is that? If we take square of hypotenuse, so that is going to be equal to the sum of base square and height square. So, this is nothing but a Pythagoras theorem. I hope children, everyone is clear with today's concept. And if there is any difficulty or if there is any doubt, please feel free to drop it into the comment section and surely we will work on it. Thank you.